Are you looking how to fund your interactive broker's account or to deposit money on your account? In this video, I'll be giving you a step-by-step -step overview on how you can achieve this. So with that said, let's head over to my mobile app and get started. Okay. Now let's say you want to deposit some money to your account. In order to do this, select the menu icon at the bottom, scroll down and search for transfer and pay. This is where you can make deposits and withdrawal. So select transfer and pay, then select deposit funds, select the account that you want to make the deposit to, and then select continue. So here I have several account linked already, that's why it's showing them. However, in your case, you're going to select new deposit. Now let's scroll down and we're going to take our time and go through this section. So if you do not have a US bank account, the best way for you to fund your account is through bank wire. So you would select get instructions, scroll down, and then you fill out the institution that will be sending money and the amount that you expect to deposit, right? When you select get instruction, they will provide you with the bank address, the account number and routing number for you to send the money to. That's what you'll get when you select get wire instructions, right? So it will be just like you're transferring from your local bank to an international bank. That's exactly what it is if you have ever done it before. So it's not complicated. So here I'm going to select back. I'm going to select. So I'm going to scroll down again and then select new deposit method. Now another way international clients can fund the account is using WISE. WISE is a great platform. It allows you to get a US bank account. Now once you get that US bank account, you can deposit money using your Visa, Debit or MasterCard or credit card to WISE. And then you can link your WISE account to your interactive broker's account. So I have done a video on that already. So I'll leave a link to the, in the description below how you can link your WISE account and how you can fund your WISE account, right? So let's scroll down. Now for a direct debit from your bank account, select get instructions. And for this, your bank must be held in the United States. Do you want to continue? Let's select yes. So from here, what you need is your account number and your routing number. And once you have this, you can then send money directly from your bank account to your WISE account. So here I'm just going to select finish. Now let's scroll down and select our deposit method again. Now the connect your bank via ACH method allows you to connect your interactive broker's account directly to your bank account. So if you're supposed to select connect here, your bank must be located in the United States. If we select yes, then what will happen is that it's going to ask you to select your bank. Let's give it a minute to come up. So here you can enter your banking information or select login at your bank. So when you select login at your bank, scroll down, specify your account name here, right? And then you select verify your bank account. However, I do not have a US bank account to simulate that. So I'm going to select done. Now let's scroll down again and look at the other methods. You also have online bill pay where you can set them up as a bill pay and then you make the payment. You can also mail a check which is a little bit outdated and takes a long while but it is possible. Now let's go down to WISE which I mentioned earlier. So last but not least, you have transfer from WISE Balance. So if you're supposed to select transfer from WISE Balance, it will ask you to log into your WISE account, right? So it's currently detecting the, the information that is in my WISE account. So if I say deposit, then it will deposit the money. So I've done a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can link your WISE account to your interactive brokers. I'll leave a link to that in the description of this video. So I'm going to select back because I don't want to deposit any money now. And WISE is really a great option for you to use. So here I'm going to select done. Now to withdraw money, you go back to more. Select withdraw funds. If you have existing account that is linked, then you'll select that option. However, if there is nothing for you, then you'll select use new withdrawal method. So you can do a bank wire, you can connect your bank via ACH, and you can do a direct debit. And you can see, I have the option to transfer to my WISE balance as well. So those are pretty much the core functions that you'll need to utilize Interactive Brokers mobile app. Once you get familiar with these features, then you can always play around and learn more about the other features that are available. I hope this video has helped you a lot and don't forget to subscribe, give me a share. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.